teacher is, but they did a good job. I've had a few. They've all been great. That's... I wish you would teach me out of everyone now. <laughs> and I know you're always busy. Yeah. Duty comes first and everything. Maybe one day I can show you a thing or two. Yeah. That was all I uh, had to say, so. Thank you. <clears throat> You're welcome. When are you going to start wearing your... Uh... At the moment, my paperwork fully goes through. And I'm free. Hopefully tomorrow. Oh, um, small note, you'll see a giant goose egg on her head. What happened to you? Um, before the sword training, I was sparring with various people, and I went for a headbutt because my arms were being held. I, I didn't know Vakir's face mask was the plate. I kind of knocked myself out for a bit. Please be careful. I will. It's good to be able to talk to you again. Yeah, I'm sorry I keep showing up, bleeding out. I'll try not to do that anymore. Yeah, we gotta change that. I'm working on it. Maybe once I get better at the sword, I can protect you so you're not covered in blood all the time. Wouldn't that be a sight? <clears throat> That's what I'm trying for. Mm. I should, um... I like you. Thanks. I'll see you later. Hopefully. I, hope so. I gotta go make some more soap. Kinda running low. Please be safe. I will. You'll be safe too. No coming back in blood. I'll do my best. Have a Come good Come back in blood, I'll be feeding you up next time. Well then that just exacerbates the problem. I'll see you around. I'll wait until you get healed to beat you up. Not very you many people like change, but you know, this sounds very fun. Something yes. I don't like about this more than... Of course. When you were talking to me earlier about this thing, when exactly yeah. are you planning to undergo that? There is a lot I do not I like about this. Shitty. Some interesting things happening at the keep, that's for sure. Yeah, possible. I would like to shriek. Hey. You should probably come listen. Yep. Has your father been released from that clinic? Not that I'm aware of. Something to keep in mind. Farik, we might be leaving soon. Be ready. To go where? Oh, right. <clears throat> I'll uh, try and be around. Yeah, 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 yeah. It's not like you to get in a tizzy. No. Oh. When blood's boiling and battles to come, you get in a tizzy, all right. I could get the door not. God, 
<sighs> that doesn't sound good. No, then. I might. It might be best that I might pass word to the others. Start having them prepare. Go ahead. I'll, I'll be back. I'll be in my armor soon enough. Aye, uh, no, I'll return soon. Lord Kovaz is making a move. And I must perform my duty in order to keep him safe. He's attacking the mine now. What? Today. He's intending to rally a mercenary army with him. And he's intending to assault the mines today. And I did what I had to. I offered my services as he had pledged my assistance. He had asked for my assistance. And as I am now as an emissary, I cannot shirk my duties. <clears throat> you understand that even if he does take that mind, he can't hold it. Not against the robber baron, not against the orcs. You're telling me! His Elgi advisor was very much for the idea. Which means there's more to it. It's probably related to these more I said, Matt. doors and shit that are all over the place. Well, it's funny you mention such. The Elgi was very curious as to how the orcs intended to move about. But I had to inform him that the war boss was on his way, which means they have a route in and out of Agmontrod one way or another. The robber baron just reinforced his standing army there at the mines. It's going to be a harder fight than you originally thought. Unless... Unfortunately, that's how... That's how this is going to... Mm. Another no. thing. Remember, I don't know if I told you this, remember when we were in the orc stronghold, dealing with the orcs themselves, <clears throat> and there was that collapsed tunnel? Aye. That supposedly leads to another door. Oh, for the love of... Just so you're aware. <clears throat> We don't have much time, Morden. I was able to gather one. The others have all scattered off to the wind. We'll probably have to get old though with us. I... I'm going to have to get myself properly kitted out. I wish you luck. Oh, I... I'm going to need it. Remember what your priorities are. If it's not for are. the swords that's going to be in front of me, I'll be the ones behind me. Yeah. The, uh, in Lamin, in Hemisphere, intends to have the, uh, young lord be protected by his guard. So I'm not only going to be facing blades in front, but also behind. Be careful. Should things go so on. Gotta get this. <laughs> How can I help? If you want to, that is fine. Ah! There you are. Uh, Basil was wondering about something. Would you like some lunch? What makes you think I haven't already had lunch? I don't know. Maybe it's because you're mostly skin and bones, and usually that's... You know. And the kind of be the thing that, you know, you haven't really eaten. We can have you a quick lunch. I have not eaten yet. Would you like me to make it for you? <sighs> can we do a grab and go kind of thing? I kind of want to get out of the city a little bit. You know? Why don't we? Make something, put it into a basket, and we go and eat at the pavilion. Let's do it. 
<laughs> I can follow y'all. No problem. Nothing really Just much need is to use your kitchen. Anyways. Sure. I have been properly re-invited into your home. <clears throat> now I can go and use your kitchen. I'll sit right here, continuing on making some of the other bandages that I made just in case and for good reason. <laughs> Understood. It will be something very quick. I'm <clears throat> sure you have cheeses from Bucci and maybe some breads in here. You have some breads, some cheeses, and what I could do is heat up some sliced meats. <sighs> mm -hmm. We should be very quick. your sandwiches do you like lettuces tomatoes any vegetables like that yeah of course mm, i see i see good 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 i don't see why people don't and some people say it makes the sandwich soggy if it sits too long with it all together I spend the majority of my life eating <laughs> stale bread i appreciate anything else that goes on top of it Do you ever feel like things are getting away from you? Mm. Sometimes. Especially today, for instance. Going and having a conversation with Kurban, only to see Dredge come up to me, of all people, tell me that Lily might need to be seen by someone and i go what do you mean well she's out with these gladiators and your bodyguard persons out in the fields and there she is knocked out on the ground yeah apparently she tried Huge to headbutt someone head. who was wearing a plate yeah the kir all people Little bit of a seer. <clears throat> and then she went in the head and was like, No, but I have somebody that's going to train me in swords. I can't go and rest. And I had to try to pull the I'm your mom card and uh, it didn't work out. So this is what parenting is like. <sighs> It's, it's, uh, I bet your father feels about the same. You should know that. There's a sandwich. It is enough for three people. So we can all enjoy. All we need now is maybe something to share as a drink and we should be all set. Probably have a bottle of something. DM announcement. DM announcement. Is at this time the town criers, if you're inside of Nautis, you will hear that Kovaz is amassing his men and the people who have been hired to retake the stone mines. The only other drink that I know what your father has in here is also a drink that Garbam almost tried to drink all of the last time he was in here. So. Did you hear that? I don't think you want that. Town cries. Yeah, I kinda heard that too. Kovaz is massing troops to take back the iron mine, apparently. Thought I heard that correctly. Yeah. Morden's involved in it too. It's a fucking shit. stupid idea. Oh, shit. Oh, dear. 
We might need to eat quickly. Who knows if they might need any people from the infirmary, especially myself. Okay. Yes. You would see a very nice sandwich cut into pieces. <laughs> Enough for each of us. Hmm. All right. This will do. A slice. <laughs> wow, this is huge. <laughs> All right. <laughs> We're just gonna mm. eat it standing Which in my spices? kitchen. Oh. <laughs> I know. I would very much have oh, liked to be in the ocean while eating. It would have been a mm. lot nicer. Well, if so many is to stay... Or how everything is going. Yeah. I would like to have a conversation with you if that's possible, Basil. Yeah, of course. Shall we take mm. a walk? Mm. You two can. I'm gonna need to go back to the infirmary just in case if anything were to happen. If they need me, I'm probably going to need to be there. <clears throat> Thank you for the sandwich, love. I'll have some water later on in the day today. Thank you. Of course. Oh. And, you wait for the leather armor, you be careful. You be careful too, please. Of course, you know I will. And yes, you did hear that right. Leather armors, me. That's a shame. back oh. 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 The, uh, <laughs> you okay the yeah. surgeon as well well i can go run over there real quick so at the clinic if you'd like but i well, don't then. think so more than why don't we send him to the surgeon? Good luck, you go two. Look for oh, your... You guys. Well, our mutual friend. Hmm? And they're waiting for By us. By the way, the... they're already gathering everyone at Tavern. Oh, there's a big crowd already. They said get some you elf. can for medical supplies. I here. How much? <laughs> Enough to How many give us at least uh, medical supplies for all four of us. For bandages, all four of us, like two bandages, yeah. <clears throat> two potions, something each. like that. Perfect. Uh, if they're selling potions, a potion each. Okay, thank you. Mm. Good luck. Uh, <clears throat> for blood and honor and all that. Be safe. Good luck, Thanes. I wasn't invited to this. I could care less at this It's gonna be rough I'm gonna have a quick conversation with Basil And then uh, I'll come and find you Don't wait up for me if you're heading out It won't be until this evening No Stay safe Yeah Somewhere shady, maybe. That would be wonderful. It is so hot today. <laughs> and it's not even summer yet. <clears throat> Perfect.
Um, I wanted your advice on something. Of course. I don't, I don't even know how to start this. I feel so... awkward. <laughs> <clears throat> Your, um... friend. Miss... Mm -hmm. Redhead. Mm -hmm. I mean, she has a thing for me, right? You finally noticed. I've noticed a while. <clears throat> mm. I see. Is it not something... Oh, that's right. A conversation from far back, I remember. Mm -hmm. We had a conversation about someone a while back. Don't know if you remember. We were at the bathhouse. We were relaxing in the waters. And you told me about someone. Is this because of that someone? Or is it too soon? It's part of it, I think. It's only been a month, so I know. I like her. I do. But... Mm -hmm. When I look at her into her face and I look into her eyes, I just feel... pain. Worry and heartbreak. Or is it another feeling? I don't know these feelings. I... Mm. I look at her and I think of everything from the past. And... How... Damaging... It's been, and how broken I feel because of it. And then I look into the future. If there was a future with her and I see pain and suffering and loss. And I can't... Bring yourself to bring her through that, can you? Yeah. As much as I would love to have you as a son-in-law, I really would. You are right, this is far too soon for you. You are grieving in your own way. You don't even know how she's doing. You're going to feel these pains. And then having somebody so close, you start opening your heart again. You worry. It's okay to worry. To feel these things. You have your heart feel the way that it does. And you can have feelings for so many people. You can. Because they're helping you with that hole, to repair it. But if all you see for your future with her is pain and loss, and you don't think that she can handle it, then it simply isn't meant to be. And that is okay. You told me she'd wait for me, and today she takes out a necklace. It's a necklace that is two strings around it and two hearts that intersect and clip together. 
She said that when I was ready, I could give her the other half. I'm going to have to go to places she can't go, and do things she can't do. Not by my choice. I know. Just like how I doubt even with... And I will say this about myself, because in a way, I'm in a very similar situation as Miss Lily. I don't know if your father would let me join in on these adventures, but Soma's going to fight for me. These places, these things you all have been facing, she doesn't know all of it. She knows some, she knows bits and pieces, she knows the politics. But she doesn't know the true scares and things you've all faced. She doesn't know what you all have faced in the past like I do, from what Soma has told me. Isn't it better she doesn't? You beautiful people. I think if you want to make sure that if you can't recuperate her feelings out of this fear of this future that you see, it is better that she does not know. She can be mad at you like she has been with me. About holding all of this in and keeping it from her, but you're doing this for her more than anything. I don't want to lead her wrong. It's a tough choice. Then don't. It's, this is going to be the hardest part for you. I'm going to let you know now. Because with her saying that she would wait for you, it means you have to give back that whole necklace to her. Not just the half. And that's where things are going to get complicated with emotions and how she feels. And she's young, Sharik. I can't do that. It's like how I... I, <sighs> I can't do that, Basil. I, I don't have it in he... me. Not anymore. Then have... If you feel that you don't want to lead her on, you don't want her to know these hardships, you want her to be safe. I'm not going to force you to give that back to her. You can take your time and think and, and try to understand it all. I like being around her. I this... do. It feels nice. I just... Then you can still be friends. <sighs> Tell her. This... <laughs> How do I put this? I guess, maybe give you uh, an example. I'm with Soma now. Soma and I are very close to the point of... He's probably going to ask your father to forge something for him for me. Something that goes on my hand. However... I have a... Pain in my chest for a name, man, the Marco. And I had to make the choice between two humans that I love very much. Who I'm going to have that experience with. And I chose Soma.
and Marco. Every single day looks like he is pained and hurt. But he still does things for me for my sake. I'm surprised about that. So what you can do... ...is tell her that you would still hold her close, but not in that way. You are still... ...grieving, in a way. And it's not good for either of you. At that point, if that is how you're going to see it. You're putting her there. In your heart, almost as a replacement, without realizing it. Can't even say her name. I know. You don't have to. That wound can stay here. But it will heal. You just need time. It hasn't been that long. Your heart will say otherwise, it will feel like you have known her for way longer. <laughs> but then again, sometimes your heart sees these loves for people. Because you wear it on your sleeve more than anything. I think you will have the courage to be able to hand that necklace to her once you can gather the words. Never been good with words. Mm. <clears throat> well. Let's see, no one is around, so I'm sure I can probably say this. Are you going to follow in your father's footsteps and be a fancy man like him? I am. Which is the then place Then you're going to need go. to learn how to use your words. This is a whole other thing. It, I know. But at the same time, maybe that's the mindset you have to be when you hand that to her. So you don't break down in front of her. Make it hard. You're a good boy, Sharik. This stuff is going to be tough. keep collecting trinkets from girls I miss. I see. I have a question for you then. Sharik. Do you have anyone that you have a sight of the future, where it's not that. In terms of romance? In terms of anyone that you can hold close. No. I don't get that. Hmm. I'm, I'm not allowed that. Why? It's just always how it's been. Every time I look into the future, it's no, just ex me. Explain. 
It's just you. Is it? Yeah. Hmm. This kind of reminds me of, uh... When I was your age, actually. Not knowing what to do, the future being scary, thinking I'm going to be alone. And that's all I'm going to see. Now I see a future... ...for here. And hopefully for where you all are going. Because someone's going to take me, if he's going with you. Be walking and Lily gets that choice. <sighs> yes, but... For love? Rational feeling. I would fall through him. How do I put this? I have said this to him. I will follow him to the ends of the earths. He is the sun, moon, and stars, my universe before me. It's cheesy and stupid, but. Forgive me for as I long say as I will before. live, I will make sure. Really? <laughs> now she's gone. Mm. Mm. Well, if a very spooky lady. Didn't scare me away from Soma. Knowing what he probably is doesn't scare me away. Getting to know him, I realize that I do not want this man to be alone ever again. Lucky him. So maybe you need to find someone who wants to be that for you. And if Lily seems to be like that, maybe. Hmm. Now this is your feelings at this point. Even if I did, it wouldn't matter if I am going to follow in his footsteps. It couldn't be. You see what I mean? Mm, the conundrum. You would need someone respectable who's able to take care of themselves. Someone who has seen hardships. It's not even something I think about. <laughs> I can't allow myself to think about that. I see. And right now I'm done with the whole romance thing. I don't have that heart anymore. When you love so deeply, you're s you've and every you're time feeling slowly. Then, if you do not feel that you are ready for this, then you are not ready. If that is your feelings, even if you like her. You give her back the necklace, but you explain to her. Tell her this is probably hurting us both, because it is. It's hurting you to say this, and it's hurting her to get the necklace back. Give it a day. It won't lead her on. It will give you the time to think. Clear your head. Think it over. Oh. Hmm. I get in a fight that I don't end up walking away from, and then it's... No one has to know. 
No, 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 no. That, no, see, that, no, that, now that you're just trying idea. to get out of it entirely. It's a great idea. No, I think that's a absolute terrible idea. And I'm going to have to lock you up in a house and keep you all up in there so then that doesn't happen. There has <sighs> not been a lock I have ever come across that I haven't been able to get through. You can try. Is that so? Mm-hmm. <laughs> Thank you, Basil. I'm sorry I'm so... You're welcome. Poor as this. <sighs> Listen, I have been around romance being this person for a very long time. That has work only 10 years, but I was basically like this as I was old enough to do what my mother and my sister said. Entertain guests, be the pretty face, dance and sing and entertain. So I learned a lot of this stuff very quick, at a very young age. Sounds nice. No, not really. <laughs> because all of those were for our masters. I was lucky to have things that I liked and to be with my family for as long as I did. I will say that that is one thing that I am lucky for. But the treatment... No. Being this type of person, learning this stuff too young... No, but it makes... Uh, good advice, I should say, from somebody who has lived it. Been a part of certain things. Not do the exact same, I mean, I'm... I'm no... You know... Son of a noble persons. I mean, I don't really know. My mother and father got into debt. I don't even remember what type of house we had. Or what city we lived in. Things change and move so much in what feels like a blink of the eye. I could have probably passed through Naltus three times over during my walk and never would have known because things change so much, you know? Especially for people like us. Ten years ago, this place looked different. Oh, absolutely. Sometimes I wish I was human. <laughs> things would move slower. Well, not slower, but... That's why I choose my experiences carefully. <laughs> because for me, it feels like days are going by... So slow, because I'm feeling the moment. But then I realize that if... He isn't what we're thinking. And he does live the life of a human. Then that's my experience. And I have to keep that. I've only had a couple myself. A proper experience. Like Soma. They're hard. They're very hard, especially to get over. But you will. And you will heal. It just takes us time. And we have to surround ourselves with people that care about us. That care about our well-being. That want us safe and sound. And you being around the people that you are. I can see that that's what they feel like. Sarah especially. No. I don't know, it's all a lot. <clears throat> it's strange. Oh. Wow. Again, it's only been a month. 
healing is natural. I mean, look at your father, for instance. He's sad. And he misses her very much. That's a feeling that's going to hold on for a while, but you have to realize that... For him, he won't get to heal the same way. Clifford. Strange mask man, never mind. Clifford. It's almost, it's almost time. I'll get ready. If you can't join, then... No, I think we've wrapped Sorry up Sorry to cut this short. No, it's okay. We were just getting to the point where it's just going to be on repeat, where I tell him that his friends love him very much. So they keep telling me. Well, you should always believe it. I have done. Thanks, Basil. Don't, rem don't remember that night? You're welcome. All those years ago, I dragged you up to the surgery so Soma could look after you because you were cross-faded on Sir Serenity and Ale. You were on Serenity? I'm gonna <sighs> get my stuff. <clears throat> Y'all want to know why he doesn't say Lily's name? Actually, I'm going to take a second. I'll be right back. I'll wait until the ad breaks over. But you're all wrong. I got no ads. Yeah, you can wait. <laughs>
I like that it tells me though. That's nice. <clears throat> the card of iron? Uh, it was implied delivered. I did check before session. <clears throat> he doesn't say Lily's name because Lily was his mother's name. And every time he uses it and talks to her, he sees his mum. There he is. We've been looking for you. Sir. You want to come with us, right? Yes, please. I'd like to make sure the kids are okay. Uh, let me go. Uh, he he here they come. Okay, I'll go get the child and get them put in my basket so I can carry them on on the horse. Right, we're taking the horse then. With them. Aye. That's what that's what uh, Clifford wanted was uh, take them on the horse. So I was going to hold the baby in my arms. I'll saddle up. Alright, let me Don't go get the baby. Sure. Uh, oh, so you want me to carry the little girl today, or do you want to carry the Just get him ready, I'll be back. Okay. Yep. Lily Blint was his mother's name. That's been in my character sheet since day one of FT. <clears throat> That's why he refuses to say her name. Even when he's Sevatar, you'll notice. Does he know his father's name? No, he never met his father. His father's name, The. Last name, Viper. Sounds similar. Yeah, a little too close to comfort, but All right, I have the supplies. We're going to go out the uh, front way, since we can't go that way, since they're taking on the quarry. We'll ride with you. Be close I enough. won't be able to move. I just remember that. If you uh, uh, switch... Reset, cause I've tried it, and it works If you reset. switch avatars now. while you're riding, that works as well. Also, if you're riding rather than um, being the actual person in control, you sometimes can do that too. Alright, let's see what he, let's see if this works. There we go. Oh, yep, it works. There we go. Perfect. <clears throat> right. Let me just swap back to my incognito. Oh my god, it's Ro! Him a name yet. Yes, um, <laughs> this is Maelstrom. Yeah, that... Maelstrom, okay. He's a That's good boy. Name, yeah. <laughs> Fine war horse. <laughs> yes, he's a good boy. Right. Did you leave a note for your father so he knew where you would be? He knew I was uh, going to be doing this, but I guess I should leave something specific. One moment. Okay. Mm -hmm. Specifics are always better. Yeah. Just so he's not worrying where you're at. <laughs> Careful, there's three of us in here. <sighs> Baby on board. <laughs> <laughs> I'm gonna add a toggle to the horse to where it puts out that little triangle sign says baby on board. <laughs> 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 
All right, shall we? All right. All right, let's go out the front gate then. I'm so proud of us, Clifford. Look at us. Raising a kid together. <laughs> oh my god. I'm gonna leave that responsibility to you you if I do pass, but wait, wait, isn't it Morden? Isn't Morden have it right now? Or what? We still work on that one. I still have Okay. Yeah, I... Okay. Okay. Yeah, I would grab it. He's gonna grab his armor just in case, cause he'll be out there overnight with us. Right. Let me take a look. Oh no. Let the uh, head DM know whether or not we're. Look at this brigand. On my own oh package. god. Why don't you use your okay, horse? Okay, the gods were heavy with breath, so... I don't have a horse. We need to buy one. We need to buy one. We need to get... We need to get what are they only 50... Uh, aren't they only 50 silver or 40 a, silver? A war horse is 50. Oh, really? 50? That's not that's, that's huh? A war horse is 50, yes. Well, I made over close to 70 silver in one day, today. Oh, God. Hey, you are a fucking gold digger, you know that, Harry? <laughs> Tyler? Who? I know how to rip people off of horses. Oh, Shariq. I know how to rip people off of horses. I know how to horse people off of rip. Why is it now I'm starting to do that? What? It's okay. I remember that time I, I <laughs> confidently called you Daniel, Daniel in the middle of the streets. <laughs> Having never learned that in character. <laughs> Brian? Uh, Sif, I believe Sif did that as well. <laughs> Alameda did the same. We're not getting close to the stone mine, are we? No, that's we're, it's that's in the complete opposite way. direction. Smart. Yeah, that's why we're going this way. Yeah, that's what the god said. <laughs> <clears throat> but yes, we should be fine going this way. We will just lead you off the trail a little bit closer to the river so that way we won't track the attention of the orcs. Yep. There's a path up ahead. Yeah, to the woodcutter's lodge. Never eat your own stock. <sighs> Shariq, I am feeding three different horses right now. Oh. What a nice man. I can't hear you, the wind's blowing. It's so loud, I can't... I can't hear you. It's crazy. Uh, I'm going under a tunnel, I can't... How much per day would that cost, Mr... Mr. Harry? 20. Okay, I could do it for two days then. I have 50 copper in my purse. Later. 
Those that try to charge me exorbitant prices, I feed them to my horse. <laughs> oh god. Ah, I see. So how much was it? You said 20 a day? It'd be 20 a day. Yes. Mm -hmm. You're gonna eat well tonight, Maelstrom. Um, war horse is eating. But, but Shriek, um, so what I have I'm planning in the future, um, I have a, I have a lucrative deal with Mr. Markle. I should be having an income of five ore a day of iron. As soon as it is enough to make a couple of ingots, I will constantly bring them to you to get ingots made out of them, okay? Oakley doakley. And I will keep them in stock, and I will keep your dad appraised of how many I have. Good. Just in case if emergency comes around, we need it, we have it. And I'll make a st and I'm going to start stocking up on charcoal as well. Smart. And also, I made a deal with Marco later this evening, since he's paying for this venture of the stone. It's going to lower that price that I'm paying him daily for what he can get me. Um, I made a deal to throw in an advanced healing for free to him whenever I can get allowed to give him one. But uh, he's going to give me a, a lower rate after I start getting in stone, so that means I will be able to make more flash power regularly and easier. <clears throat> yeah, we're gonna need to stock up on our health potions again soon. At this rate, we're burning through them daily. Yes, well, she just, yeah. One, the thing just took all that I have. I have nothing left. They, the thing that I had, they just bought everything. Amazing. This little, take the stone quarry back. Yeah. It seems like the... But, that's why, I mean, people say, you know... They hear I have all that silver, but I can tell you this, I can only collect so many herbs a day, the rest of it I have to spend that... Oh, oh, shh, shh. The rest I have to spend that silver on, um... I have to spend that silver on buying the herbs from the market. How's the VIP, Clifford? I'm asleep. I don't know if she's just lazy or my <laughs> writing's really good. <clears throat> When's she gonna start paying taxes? <laughs> she's gonna have to pay Fenora for rent. Time has come. I'll show she's ready for it. Shriek, we're going to lead you off this off the main road here to the river first. You got it. Once we get down here, down the hill. Oh fuck me. Well, you're dead. Sorry, Jack. I'm going backwards. I'm going backwards. Uh, arrow pierces me. Daughter. <laughs> Baby shield, baby shield. Yeah, baby, At least I have a horse, <laughs> fucking broke ass bitch. Wow. I got one too, but unfortunately my wife took it away when you uh, left town. She took the horse. Otherwise, I'll let you loan it, and then I can ride it back. She, she took the fucking horse. horse. You know what, Shriek? At least I'm gonna have full steel. Yeah, you use full steel. I don't. Full steel costs more. If I could get the productive properties of steel while wearing leather, I would totally just get that instead. I don't care if it'd be more expensive. Lord knows I've been fucking trying. Shit. 
shame we don't have a runesmith in town. How'd the conversation go, Harry? Couldn't find them. Convenient. Okay. Another day. He lives to see another day. You said she was angry. Bad, huh? Yeah. Well, like you said, it'll take years. A year. Out of character question. Has Ro ever been to the Grove? Uh, no. Not once. No. Oh. No, not once. First time. Understood. I thought you were with us in that big fight. Easy, buddy. Nope. Take it slow. Take it slow. Good lad. Good lad. I can feel it. We're close, aren't we? Tell anyone she'll kill you. This is where. All right. <clears throat> uh, I thought you were here the other night. I guess not. No. This must be oh so exciting for you. 
I'll be honest, I'd rather not place it. People in this land would love to know this is. Abuse it for everything that it is. Kid will be safe here. No, she will. You're welcome, Ben. It looks thicker than I was here last. Just because we gave up a lot to get it semi established, don't know how long that will last. They're working hard on the palisade, though. Wow, you guys move first. Well, we got over over half of what we need, so they're working day in, day night, and shifts. With Tang and uh, Mar Marcus making his way out here from time to time, helping along with Siv chopping trees down at night, the ones we mark for her to cut. We're also working on that uh, cave. Tang's already made a, a den in it. We can go underground a little bit. Hmm. But he's working on it. It's getting there, though. Come on. Come on, buddy. You can bring her around to my home. I'll lay her down there. Quiet, Clifford. Nothing to say. Eat up a little bit, but not too much, okay? It's our friend stuff.
the Gregor. Vaughn. Morgan. Nicholas. Katrina. Tarek. Heidemann. Lily. Risa. Knew him. He was a good man. Committed. Honorable. You would have liked him. Yes. A knight is a different standing than a soldier, but... I gave... If you ever go visit Tazim's home, you might see a jar of Morgrim and Sir Gregor. And behind his desk, I gave him his gifts. I come and pour grow water in them to keep them alive. For now. I'm hoping I can come up with some permanent way to keep them alive for y'all's trip to... Is it fine if we kept something yeah. just between us? But, or their trip in Sure. Anyways. Oh. Can I have your word on it? <laughs> As you wish. Lucian's up there. My husband. Since I know... That a lordling would keep that yes, word. You know he'd love to see you. Of course. I'm also aware of your father. Yeah, I figured. <laughs> 